In this video, I want to give you a couple tips on how to assemble your Godox 9x35 softbox, aka the strip box. Uh, we call them strip boxes because they're long and narrow. Now I have two of these small ones and then one large one. So most of you already know that have Godox soft boxes, we all get this universal Bowens mount. It's not made for any particular soft box. The challenge is knowing which one of these holes to put the support rods into, all right? That part is not always clear. So what I'm gonna share with you are the holes that I believe line up well with the shape of this particular soft box. So when you look at one of these, there's a little numbering schema on these. Each of these numbers has a matching slot on the other side. So like there's a one, two here and a one, two here. There is a blank one next to the one and two right here and right here. This is the number three and number three, number two and number two, and a one and three and a one and three. And then there's a, another blank one next to number two. So which ones seem to fit for the nine by 35? Well, in my experience, it's been the one and two right here. So I'll start with these. I'll always start with the opposing corners. And for me, that's what's worked out the best. And then for the remaining two is the blank one next to number two. So not number two, but the one that's blank, it's not numbered. And match that on the other side for the other opposing corner. So that's the first tip. That's the number mapping that I use for this particular soft box. Now, do I remember the number mapping for all my soft boxes? No, never. So my solution is to mark my Bowens amounts. If I open this one up right here, if you look carefully on the inside here, you'll see that I've marked the Bowens mount with masking tape. Over the years, this has saved me some time and frustration so I can exhaust that frustration <laughs> elsewhere. So that's all I want to talk about in this video, short and sweet. As always, thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you again next time.